Hi, I'm Steve Cullen, editor of Total Fly Fisher magazine, and I'm now going to tie the Ginger Top CDC. I've got in the vise, size 12, B175. I'm going to take some CDC feathers, marry the tips up so everything's nice and even. Like so. Tips nice and married. And then tie that in about the same length as the hook shank. Just pull the tips until you're happy. But yeah. With your scissors, come in at an angle, 45 degrees, snip that off. Tidy the, the body up like so. Stopping just a little bit around the bend, I'm going to tie in some gold holographic. Thin stuff, this is quite thin. And I'm just going to form a tag coming down around the bend with the gold overlapping turns, come back up. And just secure with a locking turn and then Pull it back because we're going to use this as a rib as well. Let's park the thread at the rear of the hook shank. Now it's a case of taking our dubbing. I've got a mix here, it's a, a, a kind of 50-50 mix of orange and fiery brown SLF, sorry SLF, seals for. Just quickly mix that up. It's that gingery tone you're looking for. And the two colours together work perfect for that. Dub it quite generously on the thread to make a nice tight rope. And then wind this up to create the body. Stop a little bit behind the CDC because we're going to have a target point there. Just pick that off. Pull all the fibres back so they're out of the way. Tighten up. Come in with the tinsel and rib up through the body in nice, even open turns. Tidy this area up because this is where we're going to lay our floss you'll see just shortly. Come in and whip finish and everything nice and neat. You don't want at this stage any lumpy bits or we'll go whip finish and tie off. We now come in with some Glowbrite number four and this is going to create the hot spot. Come in over the white thread, taking the tag away and just a couple of turns back and forth. Create that nice even hand. And whip finish coming back on yourself. Two, three. And there we have it. The last thing you want to do is for a little bit of security and a little bit of durability for the trout's teeth is to come in be careful here because you're near the CDC fibres. Give it some varnish. Make sure you don't get any of the CDC fibres. A nice target area, thorax area for the CDC. There we go. Ginger top CDC dry.